Omar, are you liking the trip? Yes, Elvis. I'm loving the trip. And you have made it more exciting by explaining me the future tense. Good. But we haven't finished learning the future tense. As I told you earlier, it is a broad concept and can be formed in different ways. We can express the future tense in another way by using going to. We use going to for forming the future tense when there is an intention about the future. Let us say that Mr. Green is going to sell his car. In this sentence, Mr. Green expresses his intention to sell his car. Let us see some more examples. Look out! He's going to break that glass. We are going to finish our homework. I'm going to write a letter to my uncle. We can also use going to if there's a cause in the present. For example, it's going to rain. Here, it means that we can see the black clouds in the sky. Therefore, the black clouds are the cause of the rainfall. Let us see some more examples. It's going to be a very good party. I'm going to have a bad cold. In both the above cases, there is a probability that the action will happen soon. So Omar, do you now understand the different ways of forming the future tense? Yes, Elvis. Now I clearly understood how the future tense is formed. Good job, Omar. And see, we have reached our destination. If you like our videos, please do share and subscribe to our channel.